Hey, this is Tyler with TJX Survival. I'm gonna do a very quick video on some wild edibles, so stay tuned. All right guys, this is called a rose hip. This plant, unfortunately, is not quite ripe yet. Um, I can kind of see a little bit of reddening back here, but not a lot. Right now it's kind of a, it's starting to redden. You can see that it's still got a little bit of green in there with a little bit of yellow on it. So it's not quite ripe yet. But once this turns red, then you know that it's ripe. And the, the big thing that you're getting with this is a whole bunch of vitamin C. So I snap the stem off. You usually get a little bit of this fuzzy stuff on the tip. Bite that off, okay? Now, the key with eating these is this. They have a bunch of really, really, really like metal hard seeds in the inside of it. So don't bite down real hard or you'll crack your teeth. One thing that you can do is grind it up and try to separate those seeds and then dry what you have left. And again, the, the big plus for this is vitamin C. The reason why that's important is because when you're in a survival situation, you often get stuff like rabbits and meat that doesn't have a lot of vitamins. And in order to prevent scurvy or uh, what I like to call the, the uh, pure protein diet that'll actually make you skinny and sick, you, you need something with vitamin C. So we got those tips bitten off right there. Now I'm not gonna chomp down on it really hard. Just enough. Get those seeds out of it. Right there's that little seed. And it's hard to rock. And again, because these aren't quite ripe, there was a little bit dry tasting. Um, rose hip ears really isn't that good tasting anyway, but it's got kind of a sweet, tart type of taste. So anyway, this is rose hip, very, very valuable plant to identify for vitamin C. There are more vitamins that it gives you, but the main thing you're getting from this is vitamin C. If this has been valuable to you, please hit the subscribe button and thank you for watching TJX Survival.